Hi Excelers, welcome to another how to excel at excel.com video tutorial. Today we're going to look at how to compress picture sizes that you might have in your Excel workbooks, which will help to reduce the overall size of your workbook if you want to email it or save it to your PC. Let's get started. So let's look at compressing a picture size in your Excel work. So if you're putting a picture in your Excel workbook, you really need to balance out the value of using the visual with the increase of the file size that will result from using a picture. But from Excel 2010 onwards, we can reduce the size of the images in the workbook and compress them, which should help the overall size of the workbook. First of all, let's have a look at the size of the workbook. It's 253 kilobytes. So let's see if by going through the compression of the picture, it does in fact reduce the size of the workbook. So it's easy enough to do. Just select the picture that you want to compress and go into format and hit compress pictures. Excel then gives you the compression options. You can tick to apply it only to this picture. And if you untick that, then every picture in your workbook will be compressed. And also you can tick to delete any cropped areas of the pictures. So just make sure that you've completely finished cropping your picture before you put it into Excel. So let's look at the target output. It gives you a few options for pixels per inch. That's PPI. It just means the quality of the picture. So what you do is you just choose the one that's most applicable to what you're going to do with your workbook. So if you're going to print it, you're just going to look at it on the screen or you're going to email it. If you're going to email it, it's the smallest. And if you're going to print it out, you want a really good quality. So that's the highest, which is 220 pixels per inch. So let's just say for this example, we're going to email this picture, this workbook, and let's just hit OK. I'm just going to resave the workbook and let's just see. Yeah, it's reduced it. To 48 just over 48 kilobytes so that's a really good way if you have pictures in your workbooks to reduce your file size so it'll help with storage on your servers or on your pc or your laptop and also if you're going to send it via email so don't forget to subscribe thumbs up leave a comment and i'll see you again for another how to excel at excel.com video tutorial